Everybody can do chair yoga. If you have a body and a chair and you can breathe, you can do chair yoga. Welcome to chair yoga. So let's start our practice in sitting mountain. We'll come a little bit towards the front of the chair and we'll lengthen our spine upwards, grounding our feet down into the floor and having our knees hips distance apart. Taking a breath in and out here. Let's start with the chest opener, bringing your arms up to a cactus and lifting the heart and then bringing your elbows in towards each other and opening out and coming in. And then a spinal twist, twisting over from the ribs towards the left, coming back to the center and over to the right. Keep the spine tall and the feet grounded as you turn side to side, breathing all the way coming back to the center taking a side bend over to the right up and over you can take your arm over with you if you like or you can leave it down if that feels better for you and coming back into the center back to sitting mountain let's move into beam pose so keeping your right leg where it is take your left leg out maybe keep the knee bent or extend it out Bring your right hand to your shoulder or maybe up to the sky as you lean over towards the left. Taking a breath in and out to the side body and then inhaling to come back to the center. Bring your leg back into sitting mountain and let's do the other side, taking the right leg out and bringing the left hand to the shoulder or overhead, side bend over to the right and then inhale to come back to the center. Bring your legs back into sitting mountain and let's do fish pose. Bring your hands towards your hips or onto the back of the chair and extend your legs if you like out in front. Let your sternum lift up as your shoulder blades come towards each other and gaze up. Taking a breath in to the front of the body and out. And then releasing your upper body, walking your legs back into sitting mountain. Let's do tree pose. Take your left ankle across the right ankle or maybe up onto the thigh. Bring your hands to your heart center or maybe up overhead, taking a breath in. And as you exhale, releasing your hands down, unraveling your legs, coming back to sitting mountain and then taking your right foot across the left ankle or up onto the thigh, hands to the heart or overhead, taking a breath in and as you exhale release the arms back down to sitting mountain finishing your practice the beautiful breath in and out the four things that i hear is i'm scared of yoga <laughs> uh, yoga stresses me out i'm not flexible enough or i'm not good enough and being on the chair really takes all of that away for people it takes away the fear the fear of not being good enough not being flexible enough and it takes away fear of falling for some people who may have that as well uh, and everybody can do it in their own way I think people don't understand that it's not about exercise, but it's, it's everything that you do in your daily life, right? So that moment of just coming back and sitting in sitting mountain, sitting up on your chair instead of sitting down, one moment of breathing like that can just change your whole day. You're more productive. You come back to that place where you can find that calm, just that moment to yourself. And then you can go back to everything feeling a lot better. So yoga doesn't have to be particularly a, a certain time frame because it might change every time as well, depending on what you need.